Remember, each time there is an upcoming cyclone, the biggest challenge is for the NDRF and the SDRF. They have to first ensure a safe evacuation and then safe shelter. And this we are talking about about 50,000 people in total from all these areas that have been evacuated. Indian Army is on standby working with the NDRF to set up these shelters as well. Defence Minister has spoken to all the three service chiefs to review the preparedness and be available as and when possible. I wanted to take a look at this report. What does it mean when Cyclone Bipur Joy will hit today, specifically in the Gujarat area at 3 p.m.? As Cyclone Bipur Joy nears the Gujarat coast, the focus is on evacuating people from low-lying areas and the impact points. When Cyclone Bipur Joy makes landfall, wind speeds could go up to 195 km per hour, enough to cause large-scale destruction and havoc. And that's why authorities are taking no chances. Over 30,000 people have been shifted from coastal areas to makeshift shelters in anticipation of powerful cyclone. This is Mundra town in Kutch district, where locals are being moved out ahead of the cyclone making landfall. So here all these laborers who are usually living in a kacha house made by uh, tent sheet, metal sheet, and that probably will literally are blown away with the wind speed as it is expected during the cyclone uh, impact. Hence all and the preventive measures they have been evacuated, taken to the safer places in these shelter house, the government accommodation, school, dharam, shala, mandir, all these premises. Certain arrangements including the health medicines have been made out here. Nearby villages also wear a deserted look now as most locals have been moved out. And this is the place, the village called Modhwa, which is located between Mandvi and Mundra in the Kutch region, largely dominated by the fishermen community, and everyone has now evacuated. All I see, what is left here in this net, which is of course the one and only source of income for the fishermen community, entire village is now looking deserted. Everyone has left, and that was the priority of the administration, to take them to safer places. The cyclone is expected to have maximum impact in Kutch and that's why multiple NDRF teams have been deployed in these villages. पानी जो है वो यहां पे आने की जो संभावना है वो सबसे ज्यादा जताई जा रही है वैसे में अब जो घर है वो धीरे-धीरे यहां पे खाली करवाए जा रहे हैं ये सारे फिशरमैन हैं जो यहां पे मछुआरी करके अपना जीवन बसर करते हैं लेकिन अब उनको भी डर लगने लगा है उनको भी डर सता रहा है क्योंकि कहीं ना कहीं उनको लग रहा है कि साइक्लोन जो है वो सबसे ज्यादा इसी इलाके को प्रभावित करेगा बच्चे बच्चे हमारे लेडीज बच्चे सब है इसलिए डरे हुए ये सब बच्चे के और लेडीज को डर है पर हमको तरवरिया है हमको डर नहीं आता है बच्चे के साथ डर होता है With villages evacuated and NDRF SDRF teams on standby Gujarat braces for cyclone before joy With Ashutosh Mishra and Gopi Maniar in Kutch Bureau report India today